Well, I'm out of luck with the duck. Somebody beat me to the punch. Look at that. Nothing but scraps left, so it's not gonna be duck. Not today. I guess I have to get here earlier. James P. Madonna here from the Facebook group Everything is Food, Royal Hibachi Grill and Buffet, 246 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Somebody beat me to the punch. They took the duck, man. Look at Oh, two minutes? Okay, all right. Okay, two minutes. I'm not blaming him, you know, I'm just, uh, I wonder what this is, if that's lamb or, hmm. I don't know. I don't know if that's lamb or beef. I'll try one though, I mean. You never know. If it's lamb, I'll come back for more. Oh, look at that. They got new containers here for the sushi. Uh, well, that's colorful. We got some unagi. Oh, here we go. Unagi is roasted eel. Sesame seeds on it. Wrapped in uh, seaweed. Nice uh, gabadoon there. They say in Italian. That's um, raw squid, but the problem with the raw squid, it's kind of chewy. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stick with this for now. Yeah, look at this. Look at this guy. What is he doing? He's waiting for the duck to come out. He's gonna take my duck, man. You never know. This happened to me one time before. I was a little too late for the duck and uh, this this old guy just grabbed it all for himself. I right. wonder what that is. Uh, it's probably chicken teriyaki or something. Yeah, barbecue chicken, okay. Let me see if there's any fried calamari. Uh, no. Hey, there he is. How are you? I should, I, say hi to you, of course. I should have brought the Persian clubs and start swinging them, the Palavani. Next time. <laughs> I got him. I, I, I do it good. You got it. All right. That was the chef of the future, the owner of the business. The, the, uh, the, the chef of the future and owner of the uh, Royal Hibachi. Very nice man. Okay. Um, no fried calamari. Unfortunately, I like fried calamari, but it might come out later. Uh, I see tostones here. Got tostones. I'll have a couple because I'm not talking to myself though. But you know, the, the millennials are so numb, they don't even notice anything. All right, this. I'll grab the grilled veggies on the second round. Let me see if that old geezer took all my ducks. Well, it didn't come out yet. Oh. Okay, you know what? Maybe a better. Better make some room. Stick around. The man said two minutes. But I don't know if what kind of two minutes they're going to be, but I guarantee I know exactly what's going to happen. I guarantee what's going to come out. There we go. The duck, this duck is in luck, not out, not out of luck. Lucha grass. Because otherwise, what happened last time, people, this old, old geezer, they took everything. All right, that's it. Now let the, let the old geezer have the bones. All right, good. I got the duck, man. I got the duck. 
<clears throat> well, so far I, I encountered uh, two examples of millennial rudeness in, in my um, <clears throat> my weekly um, millennial report, millennial rudeness report. Got the vases going. Of course, they need to get smacked around. That's that's the reality of it. Oop! I forgot the lemons. Forgot the lemons. I got tostones. I got some duck, fried shrimp. Um, I have here uh, unagi, unagi sashimi, roasted eel, and this is either lamb or beef, but I'm sure it's good. This uh, kebab here. Now let me go get my lemons for the uh, for the ice water. All right, nice, nice big sautéed mushrooms. I love mushrooms because I'm a fun guy. Mm -hmm. Nothing like some nice succulent uh, toadstools. Did you know the mushroom was uh, neither all plant or all animal? It's actually a hybrid between a um, plant and an animal. Did you know that? Fun the whole fungi family, actually. Okay, I didn't see any, no fly calamari yet. Uh, yeah. Fried calamari, yeah. So I'll have to be, um, have to be veggies. Grilled Brussels sprouts, cauliflower. I gotta take the small Brussels sprouts because the big ones were a little too crunchy last time. So let it be. Um, some small Brussels sprouts here. Yellow squash. <clears throat> All right, so the second round looks like it's gonna be a vegan round because I didn't see any lamb. I didn't see any, um, you know, nice, um, better quality, higher end fish like last time. They have pompano, you know, sometimes they have codfish. Um, you never know. You never know what's com coming out. I just saw tilapia, which is farm raised, which I refuse to eat any farm raised seafood. So, you know, let it be not the most exciting. Um, second round uh, to have a vegan second round but what can you do I mean let me check out the seafood salad oh where is it what happened potato salad no 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 seafood salad the New Zealand green lip mussels are not marinated. They're just like steam, so there's no flavor on it. So I'm gonna pass on that. Uh, oh, what's that, some sort of Halloween cake? I don't know. Let me walk back over here. Oh, no fried calamari yet. No. Stuffed shells. Stuffed shells are coming out. And I grew up with Italian food. I'm going to pass. I don't eat something I grew up with, you know, when I'm out. Oh. That shrimp in, in a Creole type sauce always looks good, but. I don't know. Maybe I'll get some.
No, no hardcore, hardcore sashimi. Same, you know, California roll style sashimi. Mm. So let it be. Let it be some of this shrimp in the Creole sauce with appears to be um, uh, water chestnuts, actually. I guess this will also add flavor to the veggies, right? Some of this um, shrimp. Shrimp in a Creole type sauce. Right in the middle. Yeah, what's it? Red Fox has said on Sanford and Son, don't crimp the shrimp. I'm trying to remember who said that. Or was it uh, Ah Chu, played by the late Pat Morita, Mr. Miyagi, on Sanford and Son? Don't crimp the shrimp. Mm. All right. That's it. Oh, God. I had to make do with what I could find, you know. So that's it. Well, what can I say? Can't have them all. No lamb yet this week, and no high-end seafood this week, at least not yet. All right, it's round three, the final round. They finally brought out fried calamar. Fried calamar, just the rings though, not the tentacles. I just want to give a shout out, speaking of fried calamari, to uh, Salvatore Mercurio. The master of all moots, the master of moots. All right, I like the tentacles. I don't like the rings. Just like I like hardcore sushi and sashimi. I like the tentacles, but I don't see any. Just the rings. So it's gonna have to be rings. I'm really stuffed, so I'm not gonna go crazy. Okay. Playing Michael Jackson songs non-stop. Right now they got they're playing Thriller, which is when Michael Jackson was normal. Before he started getting weird, you know? Alright, let it be. Tostonis. Actually the Tostonis were good. To be honest with you. Then I'll just have I guess I'll just get ice cream next and that's it. Um We got. Oh. The Tostonis were good though. You try it? Tostonis? Yeah. Uh, whiting? No, I'm not in the mood for whiting. I'm not in the mood for whiting. I'm not in the, What is this? Chicken kebab? Eh. Cooked salmon? Not really. Okay, let it be this. Yeah. With a special lamp. 